like we got at least one bag. But it feels awful light. I said it can check it. Lots of snacks, guys. Cool. And shoes. That'll go with me. Yep, looks like I'll take that bag. Also, hold on. I will check these boxes. That's all paperwork. Okay. But the other one don't look like it's all paperwork. I'm going to try to get that. But I can't do it with my phone in my hand. Sorry, guys. Okay, guys. It was like their paper plates they ate off from and that kind of thing. So I'm going to go ahead and take these bags and head to the car. Okay, guys. Let's get on with this reveal. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do this. Then I'm going to take and um, sanitize everything, clean up my mess. And I'm going to get myself changed and get cleaned up. Um, <coughs> this one bag is, um, pretty, they sliced and diced a carton of cigarettes, a brand new carton of cigarettes. So there's cigarette ashes on everything, so everything has to be wiped down. Um, these expire March 17th, 2020. Um, pure protein, I'll check them out. Um... They're, I don't know, they're a month out of date. I don't know if I would use them or not. These expired, wow. They're way out of date. Um, 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 January 6th. So, <coughs> I'm just going to pull out um, a very dented cake pan. I think if I take a soft, I don't know, soft mallet. If anything, I can bake um, meats and stuff in this. Um, 
but I'll fix that and use it for myself after I clean it because, like I said, everything in this bag, they cut an entire, looks like an entire, um, what do you call it, um, 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 carton of cigarettes. And then toss them in this trash bag. Um, let's see, how do I want to go about this? We have, and I love finding this because charcoal is awesome to find. They can toss away all the bags of charcoal that they want. There's that. And when I'm telling you that they sliced and diced a whole carton of cigarettes, I am not joking. Okay. I am not joking, guys. That's just four of the packs. Here's a fifth one, a sixth one, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, there had to have been more because, holy moly, there had to be at least two cartons. Okay, so here's some wireless gear. It is in there. Not sure why they would toss that. But, that's pretty cool. Yeah, there's at least two cartons of cigarettes sliced and diced in the trash. And I'm not a smoker. I'm going to shake the cigarettes out. Here is a big bag of Kingsford. Um, I'm assuming that one you have to use the... Uh, as you can see, there's cigarette stuff all over the place here right now. Um, and I had a heck of a time getting this bag out. This is the one I said, hold on, i got to put you down so I can't get it out. This is why. You know, I go to these, do this by myself, and I get comments like, you're not showing, so I'm not watching. You know what? Go do it yourself. Try it yourself. If you want to, you know, complain, get out there and do it yourself. You know, um, that's how I look at it. My good Lord. There's like two cartons of cigarettes in the bottom of this bag. All of them sliced. Well, let's say the... The, the, well, I don't think there's anything but, um, yeah, and they made sure every single one is, let me just grab you a handful. Let me give you a perspective. Let me see. Oh. Okay. There's an entire bag. Of cigarettes. And there's about two cartons worth. Because I already counted ten. And there was still a whole bunch. Let's get that out of the way. I got to sweep that all up. And get that in my trash can. I don't think there's anything else in that bag. Alright. On to the other bag. The first bag I pulled out guys. Look. And it came out the bottom. Frosted mini weeds, and it is February 2021. So I'm going to take it out of the cardboard box. No need to keep the cardboard box. It's holding air, so we're good. Um, empty. And, oh, they're no good, I don't think. Because there's Dawn in this bag. I get a lot of broken bottles of dish soap. Let me see. Is it in the wrapper? Yep. Okay. I bet these are really outdated too. 
I don't know. I don't know. Part of the box is wet, part of it isn't. I'm not sure why they got thrown away. They're probably outdated. Yep, they're really outdated. January. So they were way past the date. Another one. These are honey buns. And then we have... I'm always finding cases like this. Hold it back so you can see it. And it is cracked here on the corner. But you know what? And it's missing one of these. But I can use this um, for camping stuff or for crafts. Just for me, this is fine. It doesn't bother me to have that. It saves me from having to buy it. An empty wrapper. One shoe. Hopefully the other one's in here. And it is. And, oh, I know what happened here. Looks like somebody bought themselves some new shoes for free. We have a ratchet pruner. Why throw it away? I bet it says S9, or, yeah, S19 on it somewhere. glad to take that off their hands. We have aluminum foil. Looks like somebody bought it, tried to open it, and couldn't get it open and brought it back. Wow. Um, yep, that could have been a bad day. Okay, now we have some kitty cat food. We have some bug blasts, pretty uh, dented, but it's not leaking. We have some empty containers. Look at this. I was just saying I'm about out of gloves. I'll take that. Empty container. Another legging thing. That would be cool to find some more leggings. Oh, we got... Clothes of some sort. Men's large crew socks. The package has got some soap on it. Um, but they've been opened, so it'll be something I'll ask somebody if they want. Some Fruit Loops. Um, they sliced them open. No good. These are no good. Oh, let's see. Whatever that was, it's not in the package. We have boxer briefs, not in the package. Trash. A lone slipper that's got dish soap on it. There's the leaking dish soap. I have got a half gallon jug under my sink I've been pouring dish soap into. And then I have some more. And they slice them. Trash. There's the other slipper. What I'll do, they look dirty inside. They've been worn. Look at that. Hmm. Yep. Kind of like buying stuff at Walmart. And other than the no good cinnamon rolls, that's it for that bag. So all in all, not bad. I imagine the socks, the underwear, and the leggings probably went with whoever was wearing these. <coughs> nice little haul. Not as good as some of my hauls, but um, I'm not the only one hitting this dumpster. And the other person that's getting in this dumpster, I really wish they would not leave a mess outside of the dumpster. Because that's probably why they're starting to um, 
starting to slice stuff because um, I've noticed that like the candy bags are sliced and stuff like that. Um, I mean, I've found cigarettes in the dumpster before, but they've never been sliced. So, um, that was new. And, um, so the other person that's dumpster diving in that dumpster, um, I've gone there and not found anything in the dumpster, but seen where somebody's been through some bags, but there's been stuff all over the ground. Um, where they've just kind of gone through stuff and left stuff lay on the ground. Even if there's stuff on the ground that I did not toss on the ground or fell out of a bag when I was going through it. Like, you know, stuff falls out of the bags when they're taking stuff out themselves, the employees. I pick up. I pick up. It's just, you know, kind of like a courtesy. But, um, so... That's kind of what I think has happened is um, on some of the stuff that's being cut. Um, I'm wondering if that isn't what's happening. Um, these definitely worn. You can tell these are worn. They're filthy inside. The bottoms are filthy. Um, there's no way I can sell them as new. Um, I will disinfect these, clean them up, and uh, put them aside and um, sell them for a couple bucks like at a yard sale. And the same with the slippers. I'm, I'm one of those people, I will not put used shoes on my hands, I will not put, or on my feet. I will not stick my hands inside of somebody else's gloves, and I will not, will not, will not wear somebody else's hat. I have phobias like you would not believe on that stuff. I know, it's strange. I'll get stuff out of a dumpster. But I will not wear used shoes. And I will not wear... I know people go to yard sales and buy used underwear. I won't do that. I don't care how clean they look. Not happening. But I will get brand new underwear out of the dumpsters, wash them. As long as they haven't touched nothing gross... They're still in the package. They're still new. I'll wash them. I know. I'm a little strange, but what can I say? All right, everybody. Thank you for watching. Everybody have a wonderful evening. Take care. Um, look, there's something I need to say. My channel did not start out a dumpster diving channel. Um, so please, all of you that have come here to watch dumpster diving, I don't know who's doing it. I am a urban explorer, um, paranormal channel. I needed something to add to my channel because in Missouri in the wintertime, um, the roads are nasty, it's muddy, there's no place to go. I needed to add some content. Um, I took a chance on diving one night. Um, there normally isn't anything in our dumpsters here in town. Um, and I happened to get a bunch of stuff. And I put the video up on my channel. Um, so you're going to have to deal with it. Um, the same with, you know, the people that are here for the paranormal and the urban explorers. I don't see them thumbs downing and getting upset when I put a dumpster video up. Um, please be courteous when I put my paranormal or urban explore videos up. I expect you to be just as courteous about those um, as the paranormal people are about the dumpster videos. Everybody, have a wonderful night. Thank you for watching. I got to clean up my mess. Clean up me. Um, clean up my floor and take care of everything before I can go to bed. It looks like it's going to be a one o'clock in the morning deal. Take care. Night-night.